Omazulu has terminated the contract of Gambian international Mata Cisse. The Durban-based side has decided to cut ties with Cisse, who has failed to make an impact since joining the club. Cisse occupies a foreign slot in the squad, with Omazulu making the decision to release him with immediate effect. Cisse has only featured in one game for Omazulu this campaign, with injuries also plaguing his time at the club. The Gambian attacking midfielder has only managed to play in 15 matches over the past two seasons, ends his premature exit from the Durban-based outfit. Stellenbosch and DRC winger William Likuta have parted ways in a shocking move. According to sources, Likuta has not been able to live up to expectations at the Cape Winelands base side, with Steve Parker opting to field their academy products, leaving Likuta on the sidelines. The player was offered a mutual termination of contract due to his lack of game time. The club is in a precarious position in the league, fighting to avoid the drop, they will now look to add a new foreign player to fill the fifth quarter spot before the January window deadline. Likuta was initially signed as a replacement for Stanley Dimba and the 25-year-old is said to have interest back in his homeland but will bide his time for his next move as he looks for offers in South Africa. Tobo Noreda could be on the move to greener pastures. Rumors have been swirling for years about Nodora's potential move to powerhouse clubs like Orlando Pirates, Memlody Sundowns, and Kaiser Chiefs. Previously, City had been focusing on offers from overseas, but now it seems the club is open to listening to local offers as well, in order to cash in on the player before his contract runs out. The 27-year-old's contract with City runs until June 2024, but with City's inconsistent campaign, Nodeda could be the next star to leave the Mother City outfit following in the footsteps of Craig Martin, Terence Meshligo, and Bradley Roloni. Rumors are swirling that Orlando Pirates are on the verge of securing the signature of Ivorian centre-back, Ismail Olivier Touré. The 25-year-old defender, who currently plays for Marumo Gallants, has been making waves in the African football scene and has caught the attention of the Soweto Giants. Sources close to the club reveal that Pirates are in advanced talks to bring Touré to the team as part of their efforts to strengthen their defence. The Ivorian has been instrumental in helping Marumo Gallants advance to the CAF Confederation Cup's group stages for the first time in the club's history. Touré's impressive performances have not gone unnoticed, and the Buccaneers are eager to add him to their roster. The players' representatives are reportedly not ruling out the possibility of a move to Pirates. What are your thoughts on Orlando Pirates potentially adding another centre-back to their backline and would Ismail Olivier Touré be a valuable addition to the Buccaneers? Please let me know in the comments below. More Sundowns exits imminent. With just two weeks left in the transfer window, Memlody Sundowns could be set for a major shakeup as players are rumored to be on their way out of the club. Sources reveal that Sundowns may be open to letting go of striker Gift Motupa, who has struggled to break into the starting lineup. Despite being valued by the technical team, Motupa's opportunities have been limited by the strong performances of Cassius Mailula and Neo Mima. Another player rumored to be on the way out is defender Kat Lego Mahem, who has yet to make an official appearance for the Trony Giants this season. After a loan spell at Swallows last season, the defender is reportedly open to a move to a club where he can gain valuable playing time until the end of the season.